We hope you're having a good afternoon. I'm Kim Johnson. And I'm Allie Lucia. Thank you for joining us. Good news for folks looking to get insurance through Minnesota's health care exchange. The MNsure enrollment process is moving much more smoothly after a rough start to the sign-up period. WCCO's Rachel Slavic joins us now live from St. Paul where a press conference with the governor just wrapped up. Hi, Rachel. Hi, Kim. Right. The governor touted big improvements to the Minsure enrollment process since Tuesday. The website is working as it should. 13,000 Minnesotans have signed up in the last four days. And as of 10 o'clock this morning, the average wait time to the call center is down to 45 seconds. That is a stark contrast compared to what they saw earlier in this week when wait times to the call center lasted a few hours in some cases. And the Minsure website even crashed for about 30 minutes. Governor Dayton blamed the call center problems on a robocall operation that jammed the lines. Meanwhile, he's focused on alleviating the rising premiums for those 120,000 people on the individual insurance market who don't qualify for federal financial help. Dayton said lawmakers are in the process of drafting legislation for a rebate to help those Minnesotans. My goal was that they would agree on specific language by next Monday and that uh, shortly after the, the uh, Election next Tuesday, very shortly after, I can reach out to the four caucus leaders, see where we stand, and get this uh, rebate or something uh, like it for the people who are otherwise going to be hit with these high costs. Now, one reason for those high enrollment numbers this early is because of concern of those enrollment caps, which would have limited the number of people that could go on in certain insurance plans. The governor said today, even with 13,000 Minnesotans enrolled in Minsure, they are nowhere near the cap limits. Kim? Wow. That's pretty incredible. Okay, Rachel, thank you.